What's going on everybody and welcome back to another beer review. Today we have one that is by 88 Brewing Co, which is a brewery that we just finished touring. Um, they came out with it maybe like a day after. This one guys is called Dehydration Station. All right, <clears throat> pretty cool can art um, as you can see there. I'm pretty excited for this one. Uh, the description on it here, uh, Dehydration Station, orange hazy pale ale with electrolytes. It's a 5% with 25 IBUs, so I'm looking forward to the flavor. It's just like a craft beer. It says, feel the rhythm. Feel the rhythm, get up, get on up. Uh, it's hydration time. Proceeds from this beer will help support Calgary Olympic hopefuls. Tyson La uh, Langlar, uh, Micah Zandy Hart, and Ryan Summer. So that's pretty cool. So let's get into this beer. I'm really excited for it because it's gonna have uh, some orange, maybe some coriander, stuff like that. Let's give her a quick review, some taste tests on this uh, new beer review. And you guys haven't seen the new tour uh, for 88 Brewing Co. Check it out. It's pretty awesome. Let's get right on into this. Aromas. Very orangey, right off the bat, extreme orange. It smells like I'm smelling a fresh navel orange. Mmm, very intriguing. I just want to start drinking already. Let's get a pour on it. Perfect, so it's extremely pale, as you can see. A little bit hazy, extremely pale. Very yellow, very bright. Let's get some, uh, just like just nice hazy uh, pale ale. Let's get a aroma. Mmm, super orangey, extreme orangey, almost like a Belgian moon, but um, a little bit less, a little bit more like uh, crisp and clear. Man, that smells delicious. I'm super excited to get into this. This seems like a very well-crafted, balanced beer. All right, let's give her a taste. Cheers. Oh, wow. That's incredible. It's extremely juicy. Very orange, very like sweet. It has like a sweet taste to it. Very smooth though. Decent. At the end, I'm tasting a little bit of hops, which is nice. Very subtle. Um, wow, it's a very clean, crisp beer for sure. But I was amazed of how much orange there is. It's very, it's very pungent. When you when you taste it, it's very sweet at first. Get those orange, and then uh, and then it, the carbonation isn't too high, so it's pretty subtle. And then you can kind of taste like. Almost like orange rind. It's kind of basically like the aftertaste. It's extremely enjoyable, extremely crisp. Very delicious beer. You can really taste those orange in there, guys. Very delicious. At the, it starts smooth and sweet. Um, a very, very delicious taste. Um, and then it comes in with just like a little bit of like orange, uh, orange peel taste at the end. It's not bitter, um, but it has almost like the hop, hop kind of feeling to it, taste to it, with like an orange peel taste. Very delicious, amazing, 25 IBU for sure. Um, 5% beer, man, this is delicious, man. Let's slam this bad boy. Definitely good for uh, whatever day, whatever uh, you plan on sending it, enjoying it, getting them down, whatever, man. It's it's, it's a good, good beer in my books. Oh, you can see in here, there's actually a little bit of, um, sediment now that it's settled a little bit you can see a little bit of coriander or something in there if you guys could see that really closely some some stuff floating around in there <clears throat> all right guys bottoms up this is a crushable delicious beer let's get into it cheers <sighs> wow i've never had a beer Ugh. I've never had a beer before with that sweet orange flavor. It almost tastes like orange juice. Um, like you can really tell. It's like you take a normal beer, you put orange juice in it. Um, it's better than that. It still has the respect of like the haze, the carbonation, and the body. Um, but those flavors are all there, and it's actually really delicious. I really love this beer. Um, I'm gonna give it a solid nine out of ten. Um, it's just a typical delicious 
Uh, pretty much craft, craft beer here, a hazy pale ale with electrolytes, so that's pretty dope. Orange, indeed. Very delicious, very good. I actually really recommend that beer. Um, it's very, very, very good. Very easy to crush. You could send tons of those. Um, and uh, it's just an all-around great beer, guys. That's all I got to say about it. Hope you guys enjoyed. We got lots of uh, reviews coming this, uh, this month. Um, beer International Calgary International Beer Festival is coming uh, in October 16th, somewhere around there. So stay tuned for that. We're gonna be doing that video, um, and we got lots of crazy beers to review. I just went and picked up a bunch. Lots of hauls. Uh, we got a Howler 6.2% West Coast IPA. Um, it's gonna be crazy to chug. It's gonna be a little bit harder to chug, but more fun, more delicious, and uh, tasty. We got lots of other um, IPAs to review, guys. We got tons and tons in the fridge. I can't even list them all off. There's a lot. Plus a pumpkin ale in there as well for later on this month. Stay tuned. Very delicious beer. Hydration Station by 88 Brewing Co. Very delicious, orangey, yummy, exquisite beer. Mm. It's pretty light on the palate. Pretty smooth, pretty silky, pretty fruity. Pretty delicious. All right, thank you guys so much for subs uh, subscribing, coming on by. Please leave a like on the video for more content. And uh, thank you all the members and all your guys' support. And um, I guess that wraps up this video. Go check out the Idiot Brewing Co. tour video. Until next time, boys. Have a great day. Take it easy. See you soon. Peace.